spiciness coming. Oh. I don't know what that meant. What? What did I mean by that? The spiciness... Hello guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be reacting to another one of my old watch cut videos where I had to guess people's tattoos. This video is a lot more PG-13 than my previous videos have been. I feel like this is not going to be as cringy, but I don't know. It's been years since I've watched it, so let's hop right into it. Have you accepted our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ into your life? <laughs> Jesus, I don't know. Hi, I'm Isla Dizon and I'm a full-time student. Did you get yeah, tattoos? Yes. Again, I feel like in every single one of these episodes, I'm just looking at old me and wondering, what the hell was I wearing? Why am I wearing, like, a baby romper with stripper heels? And why the hell is my hair so greasy? But aside from that, you know, not too bad. Not too bad. Not as bad as my other fits. Ugh. Oh, it's my first one. It's actually a thistle. The flower of Scotland. I think now I have about 10 tattoos. If this video hits 100 likes, I'll get another tattoo. No, I <laughs> wish. Ooh, I'm pretty good at this. Oh, oh my God, wow. Inner lip pussy. Hmm. When I read inner lip pussy, I was like, inside your vagina, pussy lips? Like, those lips? Yeah, it was... <laughs> I was very confused. That's like having a dick tattooed onto you, you know? But I mean, totally, I, the S's look really cool. <laughs> they like pussy in their mouth. What? I feel like this is a flashback to high school, like PTSD is happening right now. Top of the foot. Is that Sigma? Uh, this person really must like math. Oh, that's really cool. This one's on the shoulder collarbone, the Hello Dolly. I would totally get that on me. Lower stomach and crotch. I see scales. Is that a koi? That's a fish. Wow, maybe that's like a C-section? Ooh, love this. On the forearm, the wolf. Oh. I'd say I'm like superstitious. Yep. You guys saw the last video. Well, if you did, you know that I used to be Catholic. And now I'm like agnostic. If you didn't, you need to go back and watch that video. I will put it in a time card right here. But watch it after this video. And like a little bit on the religious side, so this stuff kind of freaks me out. Alright, let's bring out the line of people. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna focus on the wolf right now. Oh god. Real quick, hold up. It was the flannel, honestly. That <laughs> I was like, hmm, wolf. That's like a white person tattoo. And then I looked around and I was like, oh shoot, like almost everyone here is white. So that kind of screwed my chances at like guessing the white person. So that's why it was that person in the flannel or the one in blue to the right of me. I saw the flannel, but then I realized you guys probably gave people flannel. No, I, I came no? with this. You came with the flannel? I came with this. Yeah, that was another thing I was thinking at the time was that they gave people flannel in case they came to the shoot with like, you know, like uh, short sleeves. They were like, hey, you gotta make sure to cover up, make sure that like you aren't giving it away that that's not you who got like, you know, like a forearm tattoo. That's the explanation for that. Oh, okay. Okay, now that's really tipping me with the wolf thing. Can you howl like a wolf? <laughs> oh, you're a wolf. Uh, man, I was a little shit. I just asked her to howl for no damn reason. That wasn't gonna help me at all. I'm a little shit. You're repping the wolf. I have a feeling I know who got the lower stomach and crotch. I think you got it. Yeah. Do you have any kids? I do have a son. Did you get a C-section? I did not. No. It was all natural. <sighs> 28 huh. minutes of labor. Wait, 28 minutes of labor? Mm -hmm. I went through 10 hours. Yeah, no. Jesus. Do you have stretch marks? I do, a little bit. Final decision. Crotch tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> Fire crotch tattoo. <laughs> Inverted cross, my god. Um. <whistles> yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sensing like, like modern day goth. Are you religious? No. I think she's got the inverted cross. That's scary. Well, no, I don't think she's gonna take my soul or anything. <laughs> Sweet, merciful Jesus. <laughs> the math one. 
And before he even asked the question, yes. Yeah, it's, it's, it's because he was Asian. two people left and I was like oh wow it just so happened to be someone that might possibly look like they prefer they're lesbian I thought they were lesbian and so I was like hey you like pussy in your mouth right that's part of being lesbian is that god this is so hard can I ask everyone if they got their tattoos sober hold on I think they could have been you know like maybe a little like but that could just be me being a dick. Come on, girly in the flannel. <laughs> okay, mind you. Again, this was like, what, 2017? Pronouns was not a thing, you guys. Like, no one was like, oh, what was your pronoun before you, like, summoned someone? Listen, I feel like people would be like, why would you call her girly? You're not sure? That's why, dude. I don't know if any of you guys watching this remember, but back then it wasn't as common to, like... Be like, oh, what are your pronouns? Like, that was a new development. What was that, a 2020 thing? 2021? I don't know. Oh my god. Maybe she likes pussy and dollar signs. I mean, that's... Leave pussy money, right? <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> she passed the vibe check. <laughs> oh, I fuck with that person. Hey? Yeah, yeah, pussy lips. Honestly, it suited her. She got a very bubbly feel to her. I liked her style. And I was like, okay, I can see her rocking that. Yeah. You're Hello Dolly. All right. <laughs> oh, of course. Oh. Too. Hey. Yeah, I got to get her. <laughs> that must have hurt like a bitch. Yeah, I bet. No, can't. Like, honestly, the worst tattoos I've ever gotten, like, the most painful one was the rib tattoo I have. And, uh, honestly, not even my hip tattoo hurt that much. And that took about, like, four and a half hours. I wonder how bad that feels. Can you guys let me know in the comments if you have a thigh tattoo? Oh my god. Why'd you get it? I just thought it was funny how people have such a strong reaction to that symbol. Would you consider yourself goth? <laughs> no. I didn't even realize I was dressed so goth-like when I left. It's the it's boots. pretty gothy boots. I'm curious what they dress like now. Actually, that person who said they weren't goth. Now I wonder how they usually dress. Fire crotch! Just got the spiciness coming. Oh, I don't know what that meant. What? What did I mean by that? The spiciness. <laughs> it was supposed to be a belt that wraps around oh, my nice. back tattoo. And so I just add things to it every time I go out of the country. It goes Pretty cool. Down. The first part of it took four hours and I slept. You slept? Yeah. You know what? I slept during my hip tattoo a little bit at like one point. But I don't know if I could fall asleep during that. That looks painful. That is so close to your pub area. Like, I think it was on her like pub area. Oh my god. Absolutely fucking not. Jesus, no. I really want to know who Pussy Lips is. <laughs> okay. Pussy Lips! <laughs> so what made you decide, you know, you're like, I want to keep Pussy in wasn't my mouth. I fucked up. I wasn't drunk or anything. It was just a, I thought it was funny to have and stuff. It's um, the only one I hide from my mom. <laughs> what did your friends say? My friends were most were cool. Except for one. There's one girl who's like, what are you going to tell your wife or girlfriend? And I still think it's funny. I actually like the tattoo a lot. I'm sorry about that. I wonder if it faded. I hear that those types of, like, you know, lit tattoos, they fade notoriously fast. Just like, like, finger tattoos. So I wonder if it's still holding up or if he got it retouched. Not the pussy lips. <laughs> Not the pussy lips. I'm actually the math equation. It's, uh, my grandpa was an economist and he invented this formula. That's amazing. What is that formula? It measures uh, the concentration of a specific industry in relationship to a uh, company. So if the company has a Herfindahl index of one, it implies that it is a monopoly within that industry. <laughs> Look at my dumb face. I'm just, God, I hated those bangs, by the way. But that is so funny because I ended up 
constantly having to look at the Herfindel Index during the MBA program. Despite what some of you guys might think, I am educated and I'm decently smart. Albeit, I don't represent myself in the best lighting sometimes. And I, I kind of come across as an idiot. I'm s semi-smart. <laughs> You're not a wolf. No. Are you blueberry? I am blueberry. Oh! <laughs> What's the meaning behind it? My grandma always used to play Louis Armstrong for me all the time. Oh. And Ooh. we used to pick blueberries in her backyard. Oh, that's amazing. It's a tribute tattoo? Mm -hmm. That's beautiful. Thank you. I think that was the only interaction that I was a normal human being in. Like, out of all of these wash cut videos, that was probably the most normal I've ever been. Wolf! Freaking me. Oh, that is so cool. I love Pretty wolves. Dope. Why did you get a wolf tattoo? Um, it's a, a BFF tattoo. It's oh, one of my best friends, the same one. She's so cute. I don't know if I could ever get like a BFF tattoo or even like a husband wife tattoo. I have tattoos for my daughter. That makes sense. But I don't know if I could ever do that. You know how petty I am sometimes? Just... Is that I'm a dick? And that this would be a really good hiding place for a tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap, you guys. That wasn't bad. That was not as cringy as most videos. As I said, I was pretty confident that this one was going to be normal. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please comment down below any video ideas you guys have for me. And remember to hit that like and subscribe button if you like this kind of content so I know. And plus it really helps me with the algorithm and your girl is doing this full time from now on, starting like next month. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Ciao.